Challenger Bank Starling today said it will hand out shares to all 800 employees after raising £60 million to boost its expansion plans. The cash injection, led by existing investors Marion Global Investors and JTC, brings the total raised by Starling to £323 million and follows two funding rounds of £105 million last year. Read more. Starling Bank launches Euro debit card in challenge to Revolut. The digital bank said it will use the funds to speed up its expansion plans. The firm has been plotting the launch of an international bank in Dublin after applying for a license last year. In addition, Starling said it will give shares to all 800 of its employees. The support of our existing investors represents a huge endorsement of our business strategy, as we continue to ramp up our growth, said Anne Bowden founder and chief executive of Starling. We could not do this without the support of our 800 employees, who work so hard to provide a better banking experience for our customers, giving them more control over their finances. So I'm thrilled to be giving shares to them. It comes ahead of a bumper funding round for rival challenger bank Revolut, which is reportedly set to value the company at $5 billion, £3.85 billion. Monzo and Moniz have also been linked with new funding rounds in the first half of this year. Starling has opened 1.25 meters accounts for consumers and small businesses since its launch in May 2017, and the bank now holds more than £1.25 billion on deposit. Read more. Top UK fintech firms accused of editing their own Wikipedia pages. The fintech firm was yesterday accused of editing its own Wikipedia page to remove criticism with a site warning that a major contributor appeared to have a close connection to its subject. However, a Starling spokesperson denied that the editors were in any way connected to the bank. For more on this story, visit the news article link.